Oh, it's a rainy Christmas morning. Woo! Oh, Tito's already at work. Bassa or Dilly? Okay, Lang? Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's our breakfast. <laughs> yes. This is how you start Christmas Day. We didn't put our photo in a cool thing, show us. <laughs> uh, if you didn't know, Noche Buena is a midnight feast. That's what we did last night until like 3.30 in the morning. It's a Spanish Catholic tradition that dates back to like maybe the 15th century. And as you can see, the feast is still in front of me. Merry Christmas, Maligay and Pasco, Malipayang Pasco, Happy Holidays. All right, gonna wake up and then maybe go around Marigold on later. Lechon. Oh yeah, we got lechon, lechon bread. This is the star of the night. Come on, break it down. Give it to me now. Oh, lechon bread in the house, yeah. It's Christmas morning, y'all. Oh, come on, come on. The reason we're doing this is because of Aizen. Aizen, Aizen. Ready? Boom la la la. We We can make it. I'm going for a Christmas morning run because the temperature is nice and I'm going to burn off Noche Buena. Oh, it's beautiful. So many white birds over there running through rice fields. When your life's been put on hold for far too <laughs> Look at my trainer. <laughs> She's my pacemaker this morning. Lose and leave the things that kept you chained. So when you find the strength to really shed your skin. And how do you celebrate finishing a run on Christmas Day? by trying your girlfriend's new product at her store, Puto de Nuguan. Literally it's Puto with salted egg, cheese, and inside is de Nuguan filling. That's blood. Mmm, it's super good. Oh, it's really good. I endorse it. You can order this from three and they come where gone done. <laughs> oh, that's actually super good, look at it. Mmm. Mmm. Nice one, love. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh, this is so hard. Sorry. It's Hello, been selling yeah. taho for Esti. like 43 years. Oh my gosh. We grew up buying taho from him. Is he selling it now? Is it actually... Yes, it's breakfast taho. Amazing. Oh. So this is unexpected. Uh, Feel good story about social media coming up now. Oh my gosh. He now has a bike. No way. Before he would carry it, or one of his um, apostles would carry it for him. But then, one. Uh, maybe... Let's get the mug. Let's get the mug to me. Oh. It's already there. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. But like maybe two or three weeks ago, I saw him and I said, Oh, Mama, it's nice to see you. And then he told me, uh, Kathy, you grew up beautiful. <laughs> and I was like, oh, well, Mario, thank you. And then we were chatting and I asked if I can take a photo of him. So I took a photo. Oh, 
posted it on social media and it became viral. And so now... That one of the... Oh. So now he has a bike cart. <laughs> mm. Thank you, Manong. Mm. It's really good. Legend. You know, we found out from the post that he would give free taho to a special child and even to people who, do, who cannot afford to pay for the taho as utang. So he would be like, just get it and they get it for, for free. Really? Yeah. You're legend. Mang Mario, salama. Salamat din. Ayos. Uy! 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 So that straight ahead of me, now behind me, is the main road in Marigondon. This is where Tito or Thrine's dad's family lives. It's like its own barangay, uh, but it's whole family. Everyone here is relatives. Christmas party number two coming up. <laughs> Literally every house to my right and left is all relatives. I think it's a family against family dance battle. This is getting tense. And we are back in Manila and Threen is so excited because we're about to do her favorite thing in the city. <laughs>
it and we even got a seat. <laughs> Three. Are you okay? You got your stuff? <laughs> Double check your stuff. Good? <laughs> you know what? The MRT could actually be the most economical and uh, quickest way to get across Manila if you don't take it during rush hour. Anyways, there's a lot of people that there weren't people that we got to see. Life is good. We're going to go somewhere now. Do you enjoy that? Three loved it. It was our date in Manila. We're just gonna drive a few blocks. We always see the uh, the negative like taxi scam viral videos, but you know, just like now, we hopped in and he hit the meter and he's a good guy without even us asking. So you know, again, of course there are a lot of difficult uh, you know people who drive taxis, but there's also a lot of awesome, awesome, honest people like this guy just now. I don't even know his name. bag from Thurin. Marigondon. Lekong Marigondon if you want that bag. Yeah. A lady who takes the MRT in a local taxi and then walks to the sun deserves to be have her shop plugged on my YouTube. Yeah. Thurin. Okay, so there's this big red building on the corner of Belletti Drive and I think it's Aurora Boulevard, right near Robinson's Magnolia. And uh, this is where I go to get anything done with my drone or things I need for a drone or just fixing a place called Lazarus Drone Repair. And I just want to show you this because these guys are awesome. And uh, yeah, actually, if you have any drone issues or anything to do with drones, these are the people you want to go to. What do you this <laughs> uh, Drone shop. Mr. Uh, going to the drone shop. Oh, I'm going to ask. <laughs> Look at the cats, what the heck? Oh, it's us. Such an old school building, I love it. Let's go see John. I think it's John. If it's not John, I apologize, John. Oh, but it looks like you. That's the future you. There's Badits in the background and a white Santa. I realize this, why is Santa always white? He could be any color. Badits. This is an old school building and the guard's throwing down Badits right now. I guess <laughs> I don't know if you can hear the music. see the best drone shop in the entire country. These guys know what they're doing. I've been helped by them so many times over the past two years, so I need to introduce you to them. Yo. Hi. I'm vlogging. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Where's this John here? No. Uh, it's upstairs. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just the batteries. Yeah. So I'm buying batteries uh, because I needed batteries for my two Mavic 2 originals. Not Mavic 2, oh my gosh, Mavic 1. It's Mavic 1, right? Yeah. Oh, what's up, man? It's not John, but it's another guy. What's your name again, bro? Paul. Oh, yeah, it's Paul. Yeah, this is Paul. He's one of the technician guys. What are you carrying? Is it Mavic 2? Yeah. Cool, Mavic. man. Where'd you come from? Tas? Baba. Oh, Baba? <laughs> oh, I came from Baba? Oh, my gosh. 
<laughs> Anyways, uh, where's John? Is he coming in? Oh, who's this? Oh, oh it's Hi. John! I think. Is it John? Yeah. Why, I, why, we were having a debate earlier. Anyway. John, introduce yourself. Hi, I'm John. I'm the owner of Lazarus. Awesome. And basically, he has a drone store that's here. This is Belletti in Aurora, right? Yeah. And uh, anytime you need anything done with drones, you just contact this guy. How do they contact you? How do they, how do, they do it? There's, you can just Google, right? Yeah, you can just Google it. You can just um, type in, in uh, any search platform. Uh, basically, we're there. Cool. And it's Lazarus Drone Repair or Lazarus IT Solutions. Yes. That's all you need to know. I'm headed to the airport, and I'm with my grab driver. Nelson. Nelson. He's a good guy. I like Nelson. Tagalog, galing, Thai Thai result. Yep. Nice. Good luck to you, Glass. Thank you, man. <laughs> what do you mean? Guess what's in the back? Well, girlfriend and Balik Bayern box. It's coming to Kegi and Dioro. It's already been to Maragona and Cavite. I'm going home. I'm leaving you, yes. But don't worry, all is good. Because we have... Kui and Elson. Yeah. <laughs> the legend.